all right all right all right shalom first and foremost i'd like to give all praises and glory to my power yahweh bahashim yahweh shabah hashim wahav rikakwadash and double honors be to the apostles and elders of great millstone with the brother yahweh coming at you with another lesson to edify and comfort the lord's elect so lord willing that this video is edifying comfort and exhorting to you brothers or as your few sisters that listen and learn the year 2023 the hopeful year that all prophecy be fulfilled and that's right we pray and hope that all prophecies come to pass all right especially in these times all right especially in these times and i want to do a quick lesson on what you see on the screen all right that was sent from the elder brother sakalab you know he posted this in the chat and as you see it's a screenshot um which reads belief in, in god in the u.s dips to 81 percent a new low you know and this is uh you know this is all according to biblical prophecy you see all according to biblical prophecy and that shows you that the most high yahweh shema Shah is going to screw these people here in america babylon the greek all right mainly in babylon the greek all right for their uh disbelief you know and ultimately for amongst our people you know the, the uh, unbelieving spirits of our people or you so-called black latino native americans and you see now this place is a uh, waxing worse and worse you know because esau promotes nothing but wickedness here in babylon the greek you know these people are indulging in all type of false religions false idols you know join unto idols you know a bunch of satan worshiping all right this is what all goes down in america a cess a cesspool full of demons you know america just creates you correct america you know it, it only create you know wickedness and demons on people when people are being the biggest demons that they can be here in babylon the greek that's why i said the belief in the in god in the u.s dips to 81 percent a new low you see the numbers are, are falling those that believe in god all right because this society it doesn't promote the truth of the most high all right the hands are the, the world is in the hands of the wicked and he promotes nothing but wickedness allow these people to believe in satanism worship satan all right and it's only going it's only going to decrease all right according to biblical prophecy according to second edges 5 and verse 1 nevertheless at the coming the tokens coming the token as the coming the tokens behold the days shall come that with that they which dwell upon the earth shall be taken in great number that's right a lot of these people are going to be taken in a great number the lord is going to drop a lot of these people majority uh, of these people on, uh, in babylon the greek all right and especially among you israelites man the lord is about to slaughter two-thirds of you and that's a great number well as these heathens and the way of truth shall be hidden that's right the way of truth shall be hidden because first and foremost the lord's not going to have his his men all right, his prophets on the scene in the time of Jacob's trouble, in the time of uh, uh, chaos and calamity. So the way of truth is going to be hidden. You're not going to be able to go on the internet, all right, and search up the prophets. You're not going to be able to walk past the, the altars, all right? So the way of truth is going to be hidden. And listen to this. And the land shall be bearing of faith, you see? The land shall be bearing of faith. And this is a great example, all right? A new load. Of, of 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 disbelief here in america all right the numbers are dropping so guess what man these people are are are, are faithless you know none of the most high the most high is not any of these people thoughts let me grab that especially the wicked all right and you got two-thirds of our people they're wicked along with the wicked which is esau edom this is psalms 10 and verse 4 verse 2 the wicked is his the wicked in his pride do not persecute do do persecute the poor matter of fact that's not the one yeah let me jump down to verse four the wicked through the pride of his continents will not seek after the most high the most high is not in all his thoughts all right starting with esau edom trickling down to two-thirds of our people who join hand with this devil all right they don't believe in the most high they don't believe in god man all right majority of these people believe in esau's science believe in himself you know they don't look towards the heavens they don't believe in the true power but the most high is going to make himself known by the judgment which he executed upon the earth all right 
And the Lord is about to bring nothing but judgment here to Babylon and Greek. All right? And, they, and these people are going to fear. They're going to fear and they're going to know that this is truly the most high. This is truly Yahweh, why Yahweh Shah. All right? Especially when the Lord sent back his son, Yahweh Shah, to crack them heavens, man. To crack the clouds. All right? To crack the sky. With the whole host of armies, man. With the whole host of chariots. Hey, these people are gonna these people are gonna seek to believe then. All right, especially amongst our people, like the scripture says, uh, "My people shall be willing in the day of thy power." This is Psalms one ten and verse three. Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power, and the beauty in this of his holiness from the womb of the morning thou thou hast the dew of thy youth you see these people are going to be willing to get right believe all right but it's going to be too late the doors of mercy is going to be closing so all the unfaithful of our people are going to die in their faith in their, in their unfaithfulness this is second edge 15 and verse 4 for all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness you see that all the unfaithful is going to die in their unfaithfulness man that's what you see here According to this article, belief in God in the U.S. dips to 81%, a new low. And it's only going to decrease because we know that these people don't truly believe in God, man. They don't believe in the Most High. All right? They believe in Esau, Edom. They believe in the so-called white man, that he's God. All right? And that's going to lead them to their destruction. All right? So this place is getting worse and worse along with these people. Gross darkness on these people's minds are getting worse and worse. All right? to the Lord take this place out in these people okay so yeah man we're gonna see these numbers decrease more more so than ever all right and it, it, it's dropping now man it's lower than what you think because we know that these people don't believe in God man you see they don't they don't do anything to show themselves to believe in the most high like the scripture said what have the wicked done to uh, the, declare my statutes you know to take my covenant in his mouth roughly paraphrasing all right. Hey, so with that, you know, I pray the list was edifying, comforting, and exhorting to you, brothers, words, and a few sisters that listen and learning. Hey, continue to cry out for all the abominations that be done in the midst of us. You see, this place is waxing worse and worse. You see? Hey, so with that, I'm going to give all praise and glory to Yahweh Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shah Ba'ashim, Wahabra Kapodash. Hey, double honors be to the apostles and elders, great millstone. Keep scribing, brothers, keep pushing. We're almost out of here. Shalom and a Baba Ball.